Hi guys, in this video we will discuss how to remove elements from a list in a loop. For example, here we have a list of numbers. Now we want to remove values between 30 to 40 from this list. But we want to do that in a for loop. Let's see how to do that. For that, first we will iterate our the list using a for loop like this. Now here we can check if element is greater than 30 and element is less than 40. Here we are applying a condition on the element and if the element matches the given condition then we can call the list objects remove function in which we will pass the element. But there is a problem here. We are iterating over the list and during the iteration we are calling the remove function to remove the element from the list. It can cause the iterator invalidation. Therefore we must create a copy of the list and then iterate over it. But if you want to remove the element, then remove that from the main list, not the copy of the list. So this way we can avoid the iterator invalidation problem and we can print the list to confirm if we are able to remove all the elements between 30 to 40. As you can see, the element 32 and 33 are removed from the list. Now, if you don't want to use the for loop, there is an another way to remove elements from a list in a for loop without creating any copy. For that, we can use the list comprehension. Inside the list comprehension, we will iterate over all the elements of the list and we will select only those elements which are either less than 30 or greater than 40. We can say less than or equal to 30 and select only these elements. So list comprehension will iterate over all the elements of the list but it will select elements which are less than 30 or greater than 40 and assign that into a new list. Then we will assign this new list to the same variable again. It will give us an effect that we have deleted the elements between 30 to 40 from the list. We can confirm this by printing the list. Now if we run this code, we can see the values between 30 and 40 are removed. So this way we can use the list comprehension to remove elements from a list during a loop. Now there is an another way that is using the filter function. Now inside the filter function, we can provide a lambda function that will accept an element and will return true if the given element satisfies the condition or not. For example, we created a lambda function here and in this we will check if the given element is less than 30 or greater than 40. If any of these two conditions satisfies then it will return true. Now as the second argument in the filter function we will pass our list. So what filter function will do it will apply the given lambda function on all the elements in the list and return only those elements for which lambda function returns true and it returns a filtered object. After that we can cast it back to list again. So now our list will have only those elements which are not between 30 and 40. We can confirm this by running our code again and we can see all the values between 30 and 40 are removed from the list. So this way we can iterate our list and remove elements from the list at the same time. If you found this video interesting then please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press the like button. Thanks for watching.